just when you thought it was all over, it could not get any flipping better. We've opened so many Forbidden Light boosters, your pants are about to go flying off in the other direction. I say hold on, I say hold on, because there's more. Every single one of these boosters that you see in front of these two boxes right here, these two brand new Necrozma, and uh, well Dawnwing's Necrozma and Dustman Necrozma if we're going to be really specific, but these are the brand new boxes that we're opening today. But these are the boosters that you could be opening tomorrow. And by that I mean, all you have to do, first thing in the description below, I've got a photo post of these, and all you've got to do is retweet that photo, and you get an entry into the giveaway to win the entire lot. I'm not kidding, I'm giving every single one of these away, and all you got to do is retweet the tweet. Um, I thought I'd definitely mention that before we start this video, because I know a lot of people came to win the giveaway, but... The real question is, how flippin' sick are these boxes? Like, dude, okay, I think Pokemon have gone for a new take, so I don't know if you remember, but usually figurines sit about here, they got a little window at the top, and that's about it. You know, four boosters here, maybe a little holo promo card, that's as good as it gets. Guys, they've gone and stepped it up like two different levels. It's in a Pokeball! It's a 3D, sort of like, you can squish it in and everything. Solgaleo is inside a freaking Pokeball. We've got one, two, three, uh, four, five, six. We've got six boosters, two promos, a jumbo card, a Pokeball, a figurine, a pin, and then we do the exact same for Necrozma. Like, these things are so legit. So, uh, again, we've got the uh, two hollows. We've got a uh, six selection of boosters right here. Not everything is forbidden light. There's only like four in total. Um, but yeah, pretty stock standard. They're pretty similar, so I thought, you know what, let's combine them into one epic video. Seeing that we're doing a lot of, like, gigantic Forbidden Light boosters, and everyone on Twitter's like, Ando, do another, like, huge opening, so I thought, what the heck, let's open two boxes at once. On the back here it says, uh, Rule the Twilight Hour with the Dust Mane Necrozma. And on the back of this one it says, Day all the morning skies with Dawnwing's Necrozma. Not too bad, pretty, pretty weird stuff. You know, it's like a philosophy lesson every time you turn these things around, but that's okay. So uh, I think without further ado, I'm going to speed open these ones up and uh, just crack into it, see what the pools are like. I'm super excited. Have you guys opened it? Leave a comment in the comment section below. Are you planning on it? But yeah, let's crack these bad boys open. Let's crack these bad boys open. Let's crack these bad boys open and get these uh, Pokeballs open as well. I'm excited. Let's do it. So Pikachu, I know what you're thinking, Ando, what the heck am I wearing three hats for? And to that I say, I, I honestly don't know, I think you've done it in sleep, to be honest. Like, two party hats, an Indiana Jones one? What are you thinking, dude? Anyway, inside those boxes right here, get this. Right off the bat, you get two coasters. Now, these are the things that were behind the Pokeballs, but like, not only they see through, they're pretty rigid. Like, you could actually rest a cup of coffee on here. Then, of course, you get the, uh, the figurines right here. Such high quality things. Like, dude, dude, I actually get around these so much. I don't know, they look really, really cool. Then you get the uh, Lunala one as well. This one sort of stands up. I had to build it. You put, like, the middle rod at the back. Pretty cool. Now, the kicker is you only get five boosters, but they're pretty different. You get Forbidden Light, Ancient Origins, Breakthrough, Pokemon Sun and Moon, Crimson Invasion, and another Forbidden Light. You also do get a code card, so if you guys take the code, only take one code at a time. That way everyone gets a code. You also get the pins, which uh, Mum always says, Ando, make sure you show the pins off. They're my favorite part of any Pokemon box, so there you go, Mum. The, there's the pinsy inside of this one. Then you also get a couple holo cards. I mean, they're cool, but like I kind of remember them from somewhere. I think these have been printed before, and you get the exact same promo hollows in both boxes. But then the main part, the Jumbo GX. We've seen, this is literally the same one that we've seen in the past set um, as a regular sort of GX card. It's really, really strange. These boxes are basically a re- like nothing is brand new, it's all reprint sort of stuff. I mean, the figures are new, and I think the um... I don't know, like the design of the box is new, you get like Pokeball coasters or something, but it's eerily similar to everything we've seen before. But nevertheless, that makes me think the pulls might be even better though. Let's check it out. All right, you little booster packs, you're gonna try and convince me this box, these boxes are worth buying. Right now it's kind of like, oh, I don't know, it's kind of a reprint box, it doesn't really scream, I gotta get this. Especially when they're like $75 each, which is 150 bucks. For two boxes, so I'm like, ah, oh, maybe, but these are the promo cards right here. We have seen these regularly. I don't think we've seen them in a hollow form, so this is the kind of new era. 
both sets are exactly the same, so if you're buying like, I don't know, the two boxes of different holo cards, you don't need to do that. But, got Dustmane, and we got Dawn Wings. Pretty stock standard, I don't know, there's nothing like too crazy about this stuff. I mean, the attacks are pretty brutal, 130 on Sword of Dawn, and then we got Rusty Claws with 100 plus. Artwork's pretty cool, but again, the thing is like with holo promos is they're sick, but like we've been so sport with so many GX ones, when I see that I'm like, uh, it's alright. Anyway. Let's get into these boosters. I've got a good feeling. I mean, I've opened so many Forbidden Light, it's like numb to me. I can't really feel it. But let's go for Gold Town. I don't know what else we're going to need. I mean, if we get another Rainbow Rare Ultra Necrozma, I may just sell my soul on eBay because I'm done. I'm done with life. It, it wouldn't be worth living after that. I've completed everything. But there's the code card for you guys. Only take one code at a time. We'll go four from the back and have your fingers crossed for literally anything, even just a prism. But we got a water type energy, got a, uh, oh gosh, Ultra Space Trainer card, Snova, I've seen all these before, Binnacle, <laughs> Burgemite, Fennec in Reverse, and what do you think? Oh, it's another regular rare, that's alright, you know what, I'm cool with that. Now we're gonna break through, this set has a couple of cool, like, fuller cards that every time I always say, like, I don't need anything from this set, I go and pull. So, again, whatever happens, happens, breakthrough. This is the first set ever where they introduced those break cards and they sort of just took them out of the set, replaced them with prisms. But it'd be pretty cool to have a bit of a throwback, get another break card maybe. We've got a Mr. Mime, Grand Ball, Pillow Swine, Assault Vest is definitely what I need after reading the YouTube comment section. Got a Ghastly, a Spritzy, Cacnea, Reverse Pillow Swine, and did I literally just go forth from the back and destroy everything? I think I did. Mr. Mime was our regular rare. Oh, you can't just be putting Sun and Moon packs in with these X and Ys because I'm going to screw it up. Alright, Greninja, let's go back to Gold Town. Man, there's so many of these Forbidden Light Packs. I think this is actually, though, like, even though we get quite a few of them, there's not too many promo boxes that have come out in this sort of era. They, uh, they had a bit of a lull with uh, Forbidden Light sort of came out. We got Diggersby, Litleo, Krogunk, Froakie, Flabibibibi, Rockruff, and then a regular rare Obama Snow. Guys, we've nearly opened an entire box full of boosters, and got literally nothing. All I can say is thank gosh I've bought both the boxes and we're definitely going to get something hopefully. But like, oh god, what was that? The Sun and Moon was it? I hope it was because I'm going to go forth from the back. Alright, I think we did good. But yeah, I, I don't know. I don't think it should be legally possible for you to spend $75 on something and then, hey, what do you know? You get nothing at all. Oh, there we go. Holy Ridge Gigas. That's not too bad. Holy Ridge, I'll take that. And I suppose you do get your guaranteed promos and a Jumbo GX, so that's probably where they're charging the money from. Ancient Origins, now this set has got some absolute rip snorters when it comes to full art cards, like Primal Groudon and uh, Kyogre. I think it's an X and Y, so it's three. Yep, it's X and Y, so it's three, we're good. Oh gosh, you gotta stay on your toes when you're opening these bad boys, do a little dance. Porygon, Malmar, Oddish, a Meowth, Combi, Reverse Gardevoir, Oh. That is sick. That's a cool looking card. Hollow Jolteon with Thunder Blast with 80? Not bad. I actually really, really like that artwork. And like, it's super shiny down here for some reason. Not too bad. Electric Effect. But again, that's like our, that's our fourth Hollow. And we're literally halfway through these boosters. Okay, okay. Now we're onto the second box right now. Let's hope things start to pick up a little bit for Bin Light once again. Let's go fourth in the back. And, uh, yeah, I don't know. What, what, what do you think's a good ratio? Maybe, like, two GXs or maybe just one full art card. That'd be pretty nice. Scatterbug, got a Sculp, got a Litlo, Marowak, and then a regular rare Malma with the creepy eyes. Always freaking creepy, that thing. I don't know. What is he looking at? He's, like, looking like this. He's like, mmm, what's up? And I'm, uh, okay. All right, forbidden light. Then we've only got three more boosters to go. Okay, this is where this is where you're gonna start coming up. This is where you get. Oh, did you see that? Did you see the code card? It was a regular green code card. Spuper, Klefki, Gabite. If you don't know, regular green usually means there's gonna be nothing. There could be a prism, but there's not. So this is gonna be a regular rare. What do you know? What do you know? Okay, so now we got a Crimson Invasion, and I'm starting to sweat a bit. We've nearly opened. 10 booster packs and pull two holo cards. It's verging on criminal. I could file that I've been. Ah, oh, it's sun and moon, so I think it's 
Oh gosh, it's not though. It's not. It's not. It's not because it's only ten game cards. Holy smokes! This is this is too much. Mixing all these sets up. Got a Chinchino, Minchino, and Execute, Jigglypuff, a Spoink, Reverse Shellos, and another Re- It was from- okay, I quit, I quit. You know what? Don't, don't, don't even at me. I quit. Alright, we're gonna break through. Now this one right there, tell me you're getting something good in the code as well, fellas. Give me some motivation, like Ando, spawned three gold cards out of a glitch code. That'd be- what the heck? I don't know, these graphics are like going back a bit. Ursaring, pretty cool. Got a Fisherman, Magneton, a Pikachu, Noibat, Cubone, Sandshrew, Flabbbb, here we go, here we go. Swoobat Reverse, and then... We're not, we are literally not opening two entire boxes and literally pulling two holo cards. That's criminal! That's, that should be freaking illegal! We have one more booster to go. It's an Ancient Origins. I mean, hey, I mean, hey, if we get this guy in a fuller card, that's totally worth it. Because that's a sick looking card. But if we get nothing, I will personally feel defeated. Oh, I think we got a good code card there. Go three from the back, because, you know, I, I know what's happening with these code cards and the card trick at the moment. We got Rotom, Special Energy, got a Whimsicott, then we got a Cotney, Unknown, Beldum, a Gumi. This became- oh! Dude, yes! Oh my gosh! Literally, oh that's fantastic! Giratina EX, that's hilarious that the EX as well! It's kinda of bent though! Man, it's been in the- it's been in the box of the factory that long, it's got a bit of a bend to it, but that's okay! Dude, this is a Pokemon card! Giratina EX Fuller card, look at the texture, you can see it all down here! Oh my gosh! Chaos Wheel with 100. Damn, it's got that like really cool like gold outline on the Pokemon as well. Okay, not not too bad. It's that's okay. But like, oh my, I was sweating towards the end of that. I was like, dude, there's no way you're gonna redeem yourself. That's pretty good. I feel like it did redeem itself. But I feel bad if like you only opened one box and you got nothing, you know? You only got the two holo cards. Like that is such an extreme, like one end to the other. Let's still recap though. So if you were to get these two boxes, you do get those two GX Jumbo cards as well, and you get the two separate holos as well. But we've got the Jolteon holo, Regigigas holo, Dustmane Necrozma, Duskwings Necrozma, and then this absolute beast. I think I've pulled this twice before, so it doesn't like shock me because I, I knew it was a Pokemon card. Um, but it's still, this is still a really, really good pull. Ah, uh, dude. I don't know, I honestly don't know how to review these boxes properly. I feel like they're a tad overpriced, but they're like something brand new, they got the Pokemon thing, they're reprints. I'll let you guys decide. You guys decide in the comment section below, are these worth it? Do you think they're good? Um, you saw the polls, you saw what you get inside of them, it's pretty cool. Uh, but I'm really curious what you guys reckon. So leave a comment in the comment section below. Hopefully enjoyed this opening. That actually was a pretty awesome like lead up to right to the end. We managed to pull a full of Giratina. Let me know what you got in the code cards as well. Have an absolutely fantastic day. Hopefully enjoyed the video. Don't watch the like button, but most of all, I'll catch you in tomorrow's video. Just keep on gaming. Alright guys, next time, I'll see you then.